Welcome to our third video lecture on immunosuppressant drugs. We'll focus on methotrexate next, which is used primarily for rheumatoid arthritis. If we examine the structure of methotrexate, we can see that it resembles folate very closely. The way that methotrexate works is that it acts as a competitive analog of folate, blocking dihydrofolate reductase and preventing the formation of tetrahydrofolate, and therefore blocking purine biosynthesis. This drug acts much like azathioprine by inducing the apoptosis of activated lymphocytes. Now the cool thing about methotrexate is that it only needs to be administered once weekly, either orally, subcutaneously, or intramuscularly. And the reason why it's only administered once weekly is because it accumulates inside cells as polyglutamate derivatives. And therefore, you only need to administer it once weekly. It has a slow onset of action, however, taking weeks or months in order to take effect. Some side effects of methotrexate include bone marrow suppression, much like azothioprine in the last lecture, liver toxicity, both fat and alcohol, and hypersensitivity pneumonitis.